teary and calm. Beautiful. Okay, so let's talk about the teary. I love tears that it's like an internal cleansing. All right, for me, I was one of those types of people that I was so in my head. I literally stood in front of a friend of mine who was all about feeling, and I was yelling at her saying, I am done feeling, because I had, we had a really stressful, painful several years. Um, let's just say my husband, we've kind of walked through fire. All right, everybody has their own journeys, but, but we kind of walked through a lot of fire. And I wasn't, this was before I was diagnosed. And I screamed at her, I was like, I'm done feeling, I did all my feeling in Florida. That's, that's where we're, and I was like, cut off. And then realized that, yeah, my, my mental energy just totally cut my feelings off because I was afraid that they were too painful. I had so much anger. I had so much resentment. I had so much fear. I had so much pain. I had so much, just so much, like buried. I didn't want to feel it. And remember that sympathetic vibration? <laughs> As I started to allow love in, because I was great at giving it. I was great at giving love, but I didn't want to take it in. I didn't know how. Because if I open myself to receiving love, that would mean that I was vulnerable. And I didn't know how to deal with that. But as I started to, to open to that love and it started to move, oh, that energy express tears, tears of just, it was almost like a relief because when you're so, when I, I was so tight and it, if that love just got into that crack and just opened the space. So remember I was caught in doing, I was resisting being. <laughs> being is that feeling, being is that loving, being is that honest, open space within me that I had shut down. And I'm so grateful that my, my, um, I feel like my purpose and my dream is to just allow the music to move through me so that I can share love with the world. And I had to walk that walk of breaking down those walls, barriers, fears. That's why like compassion grows from within as we lovingly embrace all aspects of ourselves. I mean, I say, I've said that for years and years and years, loving life, all of it, all of it. Yeah, it's all of me, of course, because I have to go on that journey inward. I have to go into those depths. I have to live this and it's an everyday thing. I will continue to be diving into myself until my last breath because it's con life is constantly changing. And I, and I'm, my heart expands so full when, when the music that moves through, it's this highway. It brings that which is within us out into the world. Everything we do brings that which is within us out into the world. The music is this vibration. And if it's love that's moving through that music, then love is sympathetically resonating within the listener. And that energy starts to move. And that movement of energy flows through as whatever it flows through for you. For some, it's tears. For some, it's anger. Whatever it is, it's awesome. I have a harp student who's totally aware of this. And she uses the harp and she gets pissed. 
and she feels so much anger. And I'm like, bring it on, come on, let it through because it's just the energy moving through. And then she's able to fall and, and, and journal and discover that aspect about herself because she allowed it in. She allowed it in.